Welcome back to JNY Cards, where we are going to be enjoying this amazing hobby together. Today, we're going to be opening up two blaster boxes of 2022 Tops Update Series. This will be my second and third blaster boxes that I've opened up. I got these blasters from Walmart, uh, and I do prefer to buy my retail from Target and Barnes & Noble because you can get a discount, but Update Series is so good, and you cannot pass on it when you see it. And these blasters that I got from Walmart were absolutely amazing. I hope you all enjoyed that card hunting footage that I was able to get. As you can tell, there was a lot of great stuff out there, but my eyes were set on 2022 update series. And so we're going to open up two blasters of that today. But before I do, you all should consider subscribing because once I hit 500 subs, I'm going to be giving away some free stuff like this mega box of 2021 prism uh, draft picks and all of my unclaimed uh, subscriber giveaways from earlier this year. like. This hanger box of basketball, this blaster box of Donruss basketball, and this blaster box of Diamond Kings baseball. So Griff, Eagle Beast, get in lucky in Kentucky. You three originally won these giveaways earlier this year, but you have not claimed them yet. To claim them, all you have to do is email me at jnycards at gmail.com, and I'd love to get this stuff out to you. But if you do not claim this stuff, your prizes by the time I hit 500 subs, I'm gonna give it away, all right? I think it's only fair. All right, so let's get into these blaster boxes. Um, as you can tell by the information that's kind of scrolling to the left of the screen here, um, they printed, they as in tops, printed way less of uh, series, update series than they did of series one. They do that every year, but um, this year particularly, because of Wander Mania, they printed a bunch of series one. Um, I believe the pack odds for blaster boxes were um, to, to hit a gold card were one out of 38 packs, which is quite a bit. Um, and for series two, they cut it down about 45% and it went down to one out of 17 packs. And then for update series, to hit a gold card, it is one out of 14 packs, which is huge because that's actually 63% less cards compared to Series 1. Right, because Series 1 was one out of 38, and now Update is one out of 14 packs to hit a gold card numbered out of 2022. All right, so. Yeah, we'll just put all this stuff right here. Will this fit? I think it'll fit. Here we go. Alright, so that's the first box. Here's the second box. Alright, let's get ripping here. Super excited. I'm loving update series. Alright, here we got Twins team card. Padres team card. Sean Doolittle, Chad Green, Rob Rensnyder, Ren uh, Jerickson Profar, ooh, a Wander debut. What are debuts there? Josh Rohan, Zach Greinke, Jace Peterson, Jorge Soler, Bobby Witt, there we go, that's nice. We got again, Carlos Stanton, um, All-Star Game, and a Javier Baez, Stars of the MLB. That's our medallion, save that for last. I don't know. Sometimes people like to save it for last because they think it's like important. Some some of you guys don't care <laughs> about those medallions. Okay, we got O'Neal Cruz debut, Jose Quintana, Ryan Presley, uh, Tampa Bay rookie combos. Uh, wow, that's a nice card. Uh, that's a an Angels team card. We've got um, Elahiris Montero rookie card, Luke Maley. JP Frey Reason, Alec Thomas debut. We got a uh, Brian Lavastida rookie card, Carlos Correa, and Gabriel Reyes rookie card, Yu Chang, and a Royce Lewis stars of the MLB. Very nice. Look at that. I'm already, that, that card stands already running out of space on it. It only holds so many good cards. All right, we got Ryan Pepiat debut. Let's see, a Suzuki debut. That's nice. 
Jake Walsh rookie card. Um, Taylor Hearn, Joe Perez rookie, Jesus Sanchez, Brad Miller, a Detroit team card, Aaron Savali, Harold Ramirez. We've got, what is this, a blue or generation? This is a blue. All right, so let's see. Let's see if we got a rookie logo. No rookie. And it's a picture for, I think, the Dodgers? Yeah, the Dodgers. Tyler Anderson. All right. And then we've got it. Eddie Matthews, Diamond, great Diamond die cuts, Tim Anderson, All Star Game, Alec Thomas, Stars of MLB. All right, let's keep going. Wait, what's behind here? Did I cover something? Oh, yeah, that covered up Bobby Witt. We won't cover up Bobby. We'll leave Bobby right there. All right. We got Josh Stalmont, Zach Davies. We've got rookies for the Mariners. New test for the West, Bobby Witt debut. We'll put that with Bobby. Bryson Stott, that's a nice one. Jake Odorizzi, uh, Jorge Alcala, Michael Pineda, George Kirby, Drew Smiley, Steven Duggar, uh, Joe Ryan debut, and uh, Julio Urias. I seriously have gotten so many of those Julio Urias cards. Crazy. All right, let's keep going here. Um, the Yerd Estrada. The, the the Tigers the rookie duo. We got rookie combos of the Padres. Uh, we got a Yan Yankees team card. Reed Detmers debut. We got Ahiri Adrianza, Connor Joe, Garrett Richards, Alex Dickerson, Roberto Perez, Rene Pinto, rookie card. Ooh, look at that. This is a Bobby Witt box. That's the stars of the MLB. Rome. It's a little off centered, but we'll check it out later. That's nice. Sunny Gray and a Brandon Marsh rookie. Yeah, well, this is pretty good so far. It is. We've gotten all three of the base Bobbies. That is pretty nice. Now, let's see if we can hit a short break. That'd be awesome. Uh, Ryan Yarborough, Connor Pilkington rookie card, uh, Orioles team card. Whoops. Ross Stripling. Aces up, Mets team card, Adam Frazier, Tony Romero rookie card, Geraldo Perdomo, Kyle Schwarber, Spencer Torkelson, that's a nice one, Ryan Tapera, ooh, we got an orange. Okay, so, so we get a rookie logo, no rookie, Nelson Cruz, that's pretty decent, followed by Jazz Chisholm, Nelson's uh, numbered out of 299. Jazz Chisholm and a Seiya Suzuki rookie card. Awesome. That is beautiful. All right, let's see here. Let's see what our relic pack has for us. We got Aaron Bummer. Uh, A's rookie combos. Cubs rookie combos. Noah Syndergaard. Guardi the Guardians team card. Cole Irving. Luke Williams rookie. Corey Seager. Miguel Castro, Avisel Garcia, Juan Duran, rookie card. That's pretty nice. We got McCutcheon here. And let's go from the back here. We've got Helio Ramos. That's pretty decent. 87 throwback and Orion Mountcastle. And then our patch is of Marcus Simeon. Yeah. Unimpressed. Unimpressed. All right, so let's move on to... The next blaster here, that one, the first one was pretty nice. We got that Torkelson, and we got the Bobby Witt trifecta there, the trinity of Bobby Witt cards. Uh, Bryson Stott debut, Trevor Story, Matt Beatty, Brandon Marsh, rookie debut, Jesus Sanchez, Bryson Stott rookie card, uh, Jake Odorizzi, uh, Jorge Alcala, Hunter Green debut. We are like running out of space here. Just gonna start throwing cards on top of each other. Andrew Kinzer, Mackenzie Gore, uh, Xander Bogart's All Star Game. Ooh, and a U Darvish. That's our patch. Remember to patch. We'll put that in the back there. I want to make sure everything's still recording. We got Garrett Stubbs, Stephen Kwan, nice. Tyler Wade and Christian Pache, Kevin Smith rookie card. Garrett Richards. Aces up, Adam Frazier, Tommy Romero, 
a rookie card, Jace Peterson, Jorge Soler, Bobby Witt, very nice, Avisel Garcia, and Spencer Torkelson. That pack was awesome with the Bobby Witt and the Spencer Torkelson. It's interesting, um, in Series 1, I was able to figure out the correlation um, to get Wander, but then with Update Series, because there's so many good rookies, it's... It's so hard to figure, like no one's paying attention, <laughs> right, as to when you're going to hit a Bobby or a Julio. But yeah, speaking of Julio, let's hit a Julio now, right? We got Jan Gomes, Camilo Duvall, Spencer Torkelson debut. Uh, let's see here, uh, Tyrone Taylor, uh, Gosuke Kato, Travis Jovanowski, Joan Duran, Andrew McCutcheon, Brian Lavastida. Oh my gosh. I, I kind of dropped it, but not really dropped it. I kind of like, it was falling, and I knew it was falling, and I saw it falling, and so I just kind of lightly just let it glide to the bottom there. Very nice. Wow. That is a Ken and Griffey Jr. short print. Holy cow. Wow. I am a little shocked right now. It is 259, which means it's a short print. Awesome. Not a super short print, but just a regular short print, which is awesome. Griffey is a goat. So, oops, here. Let's open that up so it just slides in easier. Very nice. And then we got a Brandon Marsh Chrome, which is sweet. Followed by Gary Carter insert, Byron Buxton All-Star Game, and Austin Riley. That Brandon Marsh is pretty nice. All right, yeah. Um, you know, we, we, we didn't hit Julio, but we did hit a short print of a Seattle Mariner, which is awesome. Okay. All right, Isaac Paredes, uh, Michael Franco, Tyler Anderson, uh, Alex Digodi, John Gray, Jack Sawinski. There's a nice one. Uh, Michael Lorenzo, Eric Thames, Alec Thomas. That's a decent one, too. Carlos Correa. Uh, Gabriel Reyes, that's a nice one. You chain Brad Miller, and we got Hunter Green, stars of MLB. Holy cow, two blaster boxes. You just hit so many good rookies, man. It is crazy. All right, uh, Bryce Elder, rookie. Adam Odovino, Richie Palacios, rookie. Chris Paddock, Nick Allen, rookie card. Will Smith for the Braves, Nick Castellano. Say a Suzuki, rookie card. Awesome. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, Detroit team card, Aaron Savali, Harold Ramirez. Oh, we got our first um, black gold, which I'm excited. I've opened up three. This is my fourth blaster, and I've opened up... No, this is my third blaster, and I've opened up three hangers. And we are going to get our very first black gold. And black golds are beautiful. We got a rookie rainbow here, though, of... What's this, Pena? Yes! Oh, my goodness. Yes, yes, yes. That's freaking beautiful. And a Royce Lewis black gold. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. I gotta hurry up. This video is taking quite a bit of time. Hold up. Very nice. Very nice. We got a Pena here. The corner is a little dinged up. I can tell. But that's okay. That's okay. That's a beautiful card. We got Royce, followed by Carlos Correa, Austin Riley. That was from before. I think Austin Riley was from the previous pack too, but we got a Royce and a Carlos Correa there. That is freaking beautiful. Man, these are amazing. These are freaking amazing, these black gold inserts. I will probably try to collect all those. Those are just so beautiful, breathtaking. All right, we got James Norwood, Diego Castillo, Ricky Card, Austin Meadows, uh, Sergio Alcantara, Drew Steckenrider, uh, Alex Fado, Ricky Card, Armando Garcia, Nick Pavetta, Carlos Rendon, Shane Baz, Ricky uh, debut, George Kirby debut, Drew Smiley, Stephen D um, Duggar, Joe Ryan debut. And we got oh my gosh. I got so excited. I saw it was gold, and then I saw the Cubs, and I'm like, is it Saya? No. It's freaking Jonathan VR, followed by Nolan Arenado, All-Star Game, and a Matt Chapman. So, darn, just so, so hoping. I was hoping we, could, we would hit another P 
parallel of a rookie card, but it's all right. We have VR. That's not too bad. All right here. So here's the last pack. Um, this one has our commemorative relic in it. Let's hope we get a good one. Ramon Urias, Austin Nola, Felix Bautista rookie card, Matt Olson, Michael Pineda, uh, Ahiri Adrianza, Connor Joe, Chris Bryant, Yusei Kikuchi, Dodgers, uh, this is a Clayton Kershaw card, Zach Grinke, and we've got a blue. Come on. Okay, is that the right way? That's upside down. Okay, our blue is up. It's a rookie. Hey! Oh, that is nice. Oh man, that is a nice card. It's in decent shape. All right, so uh, let's go from the back though. Um, we've got uh, LK line, die cut, Diamond, Diamond Great Die Cut and Vidal Brujan, uh, Stars of MLB. Let's see who our patch is. It is of Jeremy Pena. What the heck? Holy cow. That um, blaster was absolutely amazing. We got our black gold. We've got a silver, oh, uh, not a silver, uh, a rainbow foil of um, Jeremy Pena. Um, what else did we get? I think we got our Griffey short print out of that as well. We got a blue CJ Abrams And we got this beautiful card right here. This Jeremy Pena Commemorative batting helmet dude. That is freaking awesome. All right, so I'm gonna pull up some cops and I'll be right back See you in a second All right, so let's check out these comps here. I did really good with these two blaster boxes here. So uh, Let's see this Pena rainbow here. It's about 40 bucks uh, His batting helmet card is about 13 bucks and this Nelly Cruz out of 299 Is about five bucks And then let me see here if we go into this pile here um, This Bobby Witt and Brandon Marsh are about four bucks each. This is a chrome marsh the Royce Lewis here in the CJ Abrams um, Royal Blue. These two are about three bucks. Stephen Kwan's about two bucks, as well as Jonathan VR's gold and this Marcus Simeon uh, batting helmet relic. So not too bad, right? Th those are my kind of four to three, my four and three dollars and two dollar cards. Now all of these cards right here, there's 27 of them. These are all a dollar each and. They're just top rookies, but still, to get 27 cards that are worth about a dollar each, you know, not too bad. I mean, some of these cards might sell for like 75 cents or 50 cents. Some might sell for like a dollar 75, but still, I'm just gonna say these 27 cards, I can make like 15 bucks off of it, right? And so let's look at our gradable cards. I got a bunch of them, which I'm very, very, very happy with. This Griffey short print, beautiful card. This card is about $15 raw. Um, and in the past, his PSA 9s of, short, of uh, his short prints from the flagship series, um, they go for about 50 bucks. And so, I'm, you know what, I'm willing to do that. I'm gonna send this guy in. I think it'll, be, it'll get a nine. Uh, and let's see here, this Bobby Witt, um, I think this will get a 10. This is a 10, I can probably sell it for like 40 bucks next year. Same thing with his Chrome, um, Stars of MLB. I can probably sell this guy for about thirty-five-ish dollars. This this card's kind of a borderline nine or ten. Say a Suzuki here. This card I think is a solid ten. This guy can probably sell for thirty bucks next year. Brandon Marsh. This is kind of a nine slash ten. These um, Stars of the MLB cards are very difficult to grade, especially these um, foil ones, not the Chrome ones. Chrome ones are easier to grade, but these regular foil ones, these are super tricky to grade. Um, and so I kind of want to experiment with it and kind of see um, how accurate I am on, on these. So this card might get a nine, might get a 10. I'm not too sure. I want to see what happens. Um, Hunter Green, uh, Reed Detmers, and Shane Baz. I think these cards are solid um, tens. Um, this Hunter Green might get a nine, I'm not too sure. Um, it does have, let me see, what are I right here? Front, bottom, corner, 
front bottom bottom corners and the back bottom left corner so it's got some softer ish corners so that's why I gave it a nine um, but yeah if I can sell all of those cards as graded cards and sell all of these other cards as raw I'm looking at about three hundred forty five dollars worth of value yeah three hundred forty five bucks which is crazy right considering that I paid 50 bucks for these two blasters um, and if we um, throw in all the fees like you know grading fees shipping fees eBay's fees my slab fees um, Tom C fees wherever I sell it I'm probably looking at about hundred seventy two dollars in fees giving me about hundred twenty three dollars in profit hundred twenty three dollars in profit from two blaster boxes that's pretty impressive right all right so yeah let me know what you guys think about this video let me know what you guys would do and if you all could please like comment subscribe before you head out and please take care of yourselves out there all right and i'll see you all in the next video